Hey you guys and good morning. Um, I know that I look rough. <laughs> uh, I literally just woke up. I haven't even gotten out of bed. Yeah, I think today's vlog is probably going to be a big mess. I was supposed to be at med clinic at 1030 in Peru. However, I skipped it, which is a great start to my day. I do have therapy at 430, which Anthony is saying he's not going to let me skip. And then it's also my mom's birthday, which is a good thing. I'm just not in a very good headspace right now. I have yesterday's makeup on. Uh, yeah, I forgot to wash it off. I was too tired last night. My allergic reaction that I've been struggling with for like three weeks has decided to all of a sudden rebel against the Benadryl. So I think I'm gonna take an Epsom salt bath, um, wash my hair, and start my day. Okay, you guys, I will see you in a little bit. That's all I have for you right now, but good morning. I am going to get ready really fast because I'm running late to therapy now. My face is freaking out. This rash that I have is spreading more and more. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it has now spread to my face. It is on my back. It's on um, my lower back, my upper back. It's on my hip. <laughs> I think it's time for me to go to med one because this, this just isn't working and I'm too embarrassed to go to my doctor because my doctor one is going to weigh me and that's why I skipped med clinic today because I just can't deal with that kind of negativity in my life right now. But I have been racking my brain on what I could possibly be allergic to and why I'm breaking out like this. Um, I've tried tea tree oil, I've tried the Epsom salt bath, uh, which I did use, and then I feel like it spread even more. I don't know what I'm allergic to. I don't know what's breaking me out. I just itch incredibly, and it's driving me insane. Yeah, I don't even feel like that's covering all the spots. And I was scratching my face so much earlier that it actually started to bleed. And I haven't been sleeping because literally, the whole time I'm in, I'm in bed, I'm itching. So I'm just turning into a really grumpy person. I'm like becoming the Grinch. Surprised my family even still wants to talk to me. I just need to cover my whole face in concealer. I really just need to get ready at this point, so. <laughs> attacking the kids coming home from school. Now I have to make the decision as to whether I'm gonna to go to therapy or if I'm gonna to go to Med One. We are skipping therapy today and we're going to Med One or the Minute Clinic or whatever it's called. Um, I just can't deal with having this rash anymore. I'm terrified that they're gonna tell me something like it's contagious. What kind of rash could you have that would last for three weeks? I'm so nervous. I don't know. But I definitely don't think it would be shingles. I don't know. Some people were like, oh, I think you have shingles. But I thought shingles were supposed to hurt really bad. I don't necessarily feel um, pain. It's like adult pain. chicken pox, though. You've had chicken pox. I don't think I've had chicken pox three times. I hate that I'm missing therapy, but <laughs> today kind of sucks. I'm having a really rough time. Hopefully this doesn't take too long because I want to go give my mom her birthday present. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go inside. Um, Wish me luck. I'm getting to wear a very sexy gown. How you doing, ladies and men? <laughs> we're done and we're going home. We weren't there for that long. 
like literally like an hour. Um, I guess it's just a stress rash that is getting out of control because I keep messing with it and I keep irritating it so it's spreading because my skin is getting inflamed. And then um, all of the crazy ideas thrown in your mind are stressing you out more. <laughs> yeah, so you guys are all saying these really scary things. It's causing me more stress, which I guess is just intensifying the situation. But she gave me, I'm glad she didn't give me a steroid because my body does not handle steroids very well at all. So she gave me something that's kind of like a, like what, like amped up, um, it's like Benadryl. the next step up from Benadryl. And then a cream. But I guess I'm not supposed to put tea tree oil on it. That most likely has been making it worse. As well as everything else that I've been doing. So self-medicating my rash wasn't a good idea. Alright, well we are now home. And maybe I can get some filming done since I skipped therapy. And I'm going to like go pick up my medicine first before I go out to my mom's house. But Anthony's going to go get his food, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, all right, well, I will see you guys later. Hopefully less itchy. So I showed up at my parents' house and this is what I see. Not my husband, but this. I got bored while we were decorating. You got bored? I guess, I just started painting. It's cute, did you make earrings or are they? Oh, nope, they're stuck in your ears. That is so funny. That? That's festive. You've only had that sweater for what, four years? <laughs> only for four years. Only for four years. It's so pretty. And here's all of our stockings. Look, there's the best one. Are you ready for your exquisite gift? I am. Don't, don't be intimidated by the wrapping. Okay. I'll let you know it took time, <laughs> and it took money, and it took effort. The wrapping actually cost more than the gift. Okay. Okay, hand it to her. Can't pee. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Yes. I don't know what it is yet, but it's soft, and that's all that matters. Oh, that, oh. It has ears. Yeah, they're not cat ears, though. I figure you can, like, you know, shape them. <laughs> she has with ears. Ah. Okay, oh, open, open. You do not know how bad I need new pajamas. <gasps> oh, my gosh, that's perfect. Oh, my gosh. And, and <laughs> that's going to fit you so good. <laughs> oh, that is so cute. I love it. <laughs> oh, these are soft. <gasps> Oh, these are soft too. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Happy birthday. Oh, you are so cute. I'm just adorable. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, it fits you like, these it's baggy, insane. but like comfortable. Oh, the two of you. That's, that's good. I'm gonna open here. There you know me. I got her a card. Let's see, should I read it out loud? Yeah. Okay. A birthday health tip. If you drink eight glasses of water a day, like they say to, I got water glasses. <laughs> okay, your new hobby will be peeing. <laughs> happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday. <laughs> oh, that is so funny. <laughs> I tried to get numbers, but I got the wrong age. <laughs> uh, did you get younger at least? Yes. Okay, good, good, good. What kind of cake is that? Is that a, that looks like apple or something? Apple cinnamon. Oh, well, she, so now it's she's apple 12. Apple cinnamon cake. Ap oh, she's she's 12. 66. She's 66. If you put six more, she could be something else. The devil? <laughs> <laughs> well, we could turn that star upside down. <laughs> on fire. <laughs> you gave your, your son an exorcism early. You got an exorcism? Yeah. yeah. No, not me. Oh, you didn't get an exorcism? No. You did? Not those yeah, dance moves. <laughs> there you go. Floss it. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Fire, 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 fire. 
Hey, you're just like me, and you have like oh. remnants of nail polish stuck on your finger. Yep. That you're just too lazy to take off. Don't burn yourself. Ow, that's hot. Look, I have no feeling in my hands. I'll do it. <laughs> okay. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Nancy. <laughs> this is the saddest happy birthday song. <laughs> Can get her a, a knife? Get her a fork. Just a fork. Hi, Nuggets. Hi, kitty kitties. Oh, you're so sweet. Can you say bye-bye? Say bye-bye, vlog. Say see you tomorrow in our next vlogmas. Subscribe.